What does India aim to achieve by launching a major mission to study black holes? 3, 2, 1, 0. Yes, in just a few hours at the dawn of the new year on January 1st, India will launch its next-gen satellite, the ExpoSat from the Satish Dhawan spaceport on the country's east coast to monitor and study the most extreme objects in our universe including black holes, super-dense neutron stars and X-ray pulsars which are among the most mystifying celestial objects. So, why is ISRO launching this mission? No, it's not to hunt for aliens. Indian scientific community hopes to gain insight into the core mysteries of our universe to get a better understanding of the fundamental questions that still puzzle the world's best scientists. India's ExpoSat will only be the second mission ever after NASA's 2021 IXPE mission with such an objective. Why did the Big Bang happen? Does time itself stop at the event horizon of a black hole? What is dark energy that makes up 68% of the universe? What is dark matter that makes up 27% even though we cannot see it? Our visible universe comprising of Earth, the solar system, stars and galaxies make up only 5% of our universe. So, we must explore the mysteries of objects such as black holes and pulsars to understand how the universe and laws of physics work. So, how will ISRO's ExpoSat help us better understand such questions? India's ExpoSat mission will study the polymetry of such objects which investigates the angle of rotation of light and X-rays emerging from such objects. ExpoSat's groundbreaking mission targets 50 brightest cosmic entities to unravel their complex structures and emission mechanisms. Equipped with Polix and SPECT instruments to explore the medium X-ray spectrum and crucial spectroscopic details potentially revolutionizing our comprehension of celestial physics. ExpoSat's mission for five years also helps shed light on high-energy particles and the inner dynamics of celestial objects. Measurement of X-ray polarization adds in deducing the orientation and strength of magnetic fields in celestial objects, including the formation of energetic jets and outflows. This is the latest in a list of India's incredible space missions, including Chandrayaan-3, which landed near the moon's south pole, and Aditya-1 mission to study the sun, which will reach the Lagrange-1 point on January 6, 2024. ISRO hopes ExpoSat will thrust India to the forefront of space-based polymetry, embarking on a journey that could reshape our understanding of the universe. So what do you believe? Has ISRO become the pride of India? Leave a comment below and if you like our news report, then subscribe to our channel or hit the like button so that it can reach more viewers.